666 subscribers. Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. I'm Belton Jasper. If this is your first time on the channel, hit subscribe right now. The channel reached a very heavy metal milestone of 666 subscribers. Actually, 681 by the time that I'm recording this video. So how can we celebrate? Well, why don't I tell you the 10 songs about 666 that you need to know that are not the number of the beast. But first, let's drink. Cheers, everybody. All right, so I'm gonna highlight 10 songs that are called something like 666 that you need to know about. And we're gonna do this in chronological order. And we're gonna start all the way back in 1972. If you ever wondered what it would sound like if the Beatles made a full-on occult psychedelic rock album, check out the album called 666 by a band called Aphrodite's Child. There is no song called 666 on that album, but I had to include this release. So check out the song, The Four Horsemen. Okay, well, in the same year that The Number of the Beast was released, 1982, Canadian band Anvil had their classic release with Metal on Metal, and on that album you can find the pretty straightforward speed metal classic, Six, Six, Six. We're gonna fast forward 10 years already to 1992 for the party thrash of Tankard from Germany with the song 66 Six Packs. So one of the most underrated and sometimes forgotten subgenres of heavy metal is death and roll, the mix of rock and roll and death metal, which became quite popular in the mid 90s including the band Della Morte with their phenomenal album Uglier and More Disgusting. On that album you can find 666 and Pentagrams. One of the most successful gothic rock bands to come out of Finland is the band Him or His Infernal Majesty. They already had a song called Your Sweet 666 on their debut album called Greatest Love Songs Volume 666, but I'm actually choosing for this list the version of the Razor Blade Romance, their second album in 1999. Okay, now we're gonna take a whole jump to 2013 uh, for uh, one of the best albums released by Rotting Christ. The title of the album is in Greek and I would do a terrible job at pronouncing it, but you can check it out. Rotting Christ is obviously, you know, the Greek master band when it comes to gothic, black and deaf music. And uh, on that album, they had the song called 666. Um, but if you look at the track list, you might not quickly get there because it is actually written in ancient Greek. Alright, we had Tanker before, but I think it's time for some more party thrash because after all, we are celebrating. So let's play Gamma Bomb with 6616. Party thrash to more melodic thrash. Um, one of my favorite bands of all time is German thrash band Creator. And at the start of 2020, they released an EP called 666 World Divided. Also in 2020, we saw the solo album of Corey Taylor, the singer of Slipknot and Stone Sour. And on that album, we have the song Highway 666. 
was ready to burn. I really like this kind of heavy, dark country music like Nurgle did on his solo album as well and you know some of the heavier songs of the White Buffalo. Really like it. But nevertheless, this is a party video so we have to end with another party thrash anthem although this is more black and speed, black and thrash. Belgian band Butcher with 666 goats carried my chariot. <laughs> There you go, these are 10 songs that celebrate the number of the beast without actually being the number of the beast by Iron Maiden that I think you should know about. Thank you to everyone who has subscribed over the last nine to 10 months on this channel. This has been a really awesome journey so far. I can't wait to make another celebratory video when we hit that thousand mark. Uh, thank you so much, have a beer, cheers, and stay tuned for more videos very soon. You are awesome for watching this video, click right here to see more content like it, and hey, subscribe to the channel.